What's happening, my curious bunch of health fanatics? Let's first have a look at a biochemical pathway that is known to extend life, and then we'll have a look at how you can regulate this biochemical pathway to improve your longevity. This pathway is AMP activated protein kinase, otherwise known as AMPK. Let's explore what AMPK does and how to activate it. AMPK is a cellular enzyme that is arguably involved in most, if not all, disease. The lower your AMPK activity, the more chance you have of developing disease. Information is power, and knowing this particular science means that you can now greatly affect your chances of not developing a disease as our biological clock sleepwalks into old age at one second per second. Professor Emeritus William Clark of Immunology at UCLA says AMPK is a suppressor of aging itself, end quote. That's how powerful some scientists in the scientific community regard the effect of this little enzyme and its control over aging. Scientists now have a huge body of evidence showing that this enzyme is one of the final powerhouses that anyone serious about longevity should be including in their anti-aging toolkit. Let's take a quick look at how it works. AMPK can sense the energy level inside cells, and we're talking about sensing the energy levels inside trillions of cells at any one time. So AMPK can activate a response mechanism inside the cell that tells cells to get back into the most perfect energy state. Too little energy and the cell dies, which can cause disease. Too much energy can cause improper cellular function, which can also induce disease. So think of some type of cellular dysfunction or disease. You may see an elderly person using a walking frame, they may have hearing loss or unable to repair from injury. All these conditions can be traced back to some type of cell dysfunction pretty much every single time. So it's not just important that the cells have their energy requirements met, but that their energy remains at a very constant rate, not too little and not too much, otherwise tissue dysfunction kicks in. As we eat food, energy is passed down a stream of enzymes until it reaches the battery pack inside our cells, known as mitochondria, which produce an energy molecule called adenosine triphosphate, or ATP. As the ATP is used to power the cell, the end product, the ATP exhaust fumes, is adenosine monophosphate, or AMP. As the cell fills up with AMP and depletes its supply of ATP, the cell becomes low on energy, possibly unable to perform functions, or worse. Rising levels of AMP inside the cell biochemically activate the release of AMPK, and this is why AMPK is so important. When new AMPK is released, it escalates fatty acid, fatty acid oxidation, which is simply a process that creates new ATP. AMPK also initiates glucose transport, where sugars are taken from stored fats as additional energy sources for the cells to function. The net result is perfect cellular metabolism and flawless cellular machinery. Fruit flies, genetically modified to have more AMP in their cells, live up to one third longer than their natural counterparts due to the induction of AMPK. People that eat junk food and live sedentary lifestyles will lower their levels of AMPK, inducing more fat storage, slowing down cellular metabolism with an increased chance of disease. The science is profound and the jury is in. AMPK levels are essential for your anti-aging toolkit in assisting you to avoid disease and maintain a youthful state. So the million dollar question is, how do you raise AMPK? Well, I'll run through a quick list that you can use. Calorie restriction or fasting will help maintain AMPK levels. In fact, fasting is one of the best ways to activate AMPK. Also, turmeric's most powerful compound or derivative, curcumin, has also been shown to activate AMPK and initiate the process of autophagy. I'll link to my video on curcumin at the end of this one. Vinegar is also shown to raise AMPK, and it should be noted that acetic acid is implicated in this biochemical cascade. My video on acetic acid and also curcumin are fantastically important videos for you to watch, and I'll link to both of those shortly. Ashwagandha contains a molecule called withoferrin A, a little molecule which is shown to upregulate AMPK and hold great benefit. So consider using an ashwagandha supplement in your anti-aging toolkit. Quercetin, which is another compound I have written about in my book and spent much time researching, is another great AMPK regulator. And finally, 
Hesperitin is also shown to be a great little AMPK regulator as well, as well as a CERT1 activator. Now, what prevents or inhibits AMPK? Well, it's actually insulin. And guess what raises insulin? Glucose or sugary foods or foods with a high glycemic index. So eat foods that don't spike your insulin levels. This will keep you closer to an AMPK activated state. Don't forget to pick up a copy of my book, The Anti-Aging Toolkit, if you take longevity seriously, and I'll link to that below. Always chat with your doctor about health data you see online. Hit that thumbs up button, fist bump the subscribe button, or face the consequences of your actions. Visit me at www.scienceofaging.life, and as always, stay young and stay vibrant.